Hey guys, Rugged Elf here. How y'all doing today? So, today, I know everybody puts the videos out for the exotic ships. But today, actually, this is going to be a little different. I'm going to show you where you can find this awesome red and silver marlin. Okay? I saw this ship, stumbled across it, did some testing, and it shows up almost every time. And I want to show you how you want, if you want like that ship and you want to get it, I'm going to show you how to, okay? So, what you need is you need a portal, okay? As you know, I like building my bases around a portal. You know, just for you know, such, such instances like this. So, I've been through it a couple of times. Like I said, I tried this. I tried these glyphs, tested them out, and verified that you can get this ship almost every time that you can. So, if you follow these glyphs, I will post them later once we get to the ship and stuff. So... I mean, if you want to pause the thing, pause the video after this to get the glyphs, you can. If not, I'll post a, a larger version of them for you once we get done. Okay? So, let's get over here and I'll show you what's going on. Now, here we go. Kabam! Alright, run, run, run. Okay. Alright, so get through here. You're going to end up at another portal. So, you're going to need to go find your ship, which will be around here somewhere. Not a bad little planet. Oni and Prime. So if you get to Oni and Prime, you know you're in the right place. Okay? So, the ship's over here. And I got a thing for Sean I want to ask him. Because every time I go through a portal, my ship is kind of buried halfway in the ground. I was like, why? I don't understand this. But, uh, you never know, it ain't getting blown away by the wind, that's for damn sure. So. Alright, get your ship, take off. Don't get out into space. See where they got the space station at. So, normally, what I do with this, I'll fly in, I'll get to the space station. This will take a moment. And you're going to show up upside down. That's okay. Because I can rotate my ship. Okay. So we go in. Bring it in a station. And this happens to me almost every time. Okay. Now, I've done it a couple different ways, but if I get out of my ship and I just stand here and wait, okay, it's not going to show up. But you want to do this. If you get out of your ship and you reload your autosave, it will still not load. It will still not come in. It's your second, is your, on this one, it's your second wave first wave of your save will bring the ship in. If you run an auto save now, you'll still have to run an auto save again for the ship to come in. Okay, I'll show you. So, you got the ships coming in. So, you see a couple of ships. They got some pretty decent ships that come in here. I mean, they're not too bad. You know? As soon as you see that last ship come in, ooh, 
first time I've seen that one. A little hover horror. That's nice. Go in and hit your autosave. Get that last ship coming into the space station. And then you want to get that, do your reload, and you come in, now you wait. And we wait. Patience is a virtue. It's something, but I don't know what else you want to call it. But... And I will do this again for you guys, because I'll show you the other way. If I come in and not automatically do an auto-update, and I'll show you it doesn't come in until you do that second auto-update. So that's why I say once you get the, you need the first wave to come in, run an auto-update, and then you'll get this, then you'll get your ship to come in. Now they can be C, B, A, or S. Here it comes, right on schedule. Hmm. That's why I grabbed one of these. These things are so pretty. I love these ships. These are awesome. I'm kind of like partial to the Jackal, but this, you know, this Marlin and this color, look, two of them right next to each other. Ain't they sweet? They're pretty. Yeah. But they, that is a pretty ship. And you got the little broken sails on them too. The little fidgety sails. It's not square. It's not round. So you get this one. This one's an A class. Okay. So as I said, depending on how you do it, how you come in, on what you get. So you talk to the guy. So make an offer for a ship. You know, it's pretty decent. You know, you got some pretty decent damage on this and some maneuverability already on this thing when you get it, okay? So, you're getting six technology slots right off the bat. So, that's pretty good. So, here, this is what I want to show you, though. So, I'm going to go back. I want to make sure we're going to do it again, okay? Now, this is the reason why I set up a base at a portal. Because this way I can test this stuff for you guys and I can let you know whether it's going to work, how it's going to work, why it's going to work, and how you're going to feel after it works. Okay? Because you're going to be happy when you find the ship you want. Alright? I'm going to run around. I'm going to try to find some ships you guys want. You know? I mean, I know solar ships are dime a dozen. But you get the certain shape and color that you want. You know, I like the red and silver. It matches my motif on how I play. So, if that's something that you like, you know, I got, I found blue ones. I found yellow ones. Yellow ones are pretty cool. I found the blue ones pretty cool, too. I do got one, actually, I got one of them on my freighter that I saved. Okay, so, here, get into my base. Say, hi, base. Okay, now we're going to go back. And we'll go right back to, to the um, portal. Okay. So we're going in here again. You know, just so I'm just, I just want to show you that it's going to show up, you know, when you get in here. It's usually your second save. So, bird, sun, spaceship, boat, anomaly, eclipse. Bug, another starship, two regular boats, a diplo, and a face. Okay, so I'll give you a better look at the glyphs. I'll leave them up there for a little bit longer so you guys can get it if you want. So come running here. So let's dive through, see what we're going to get. Well, I'll make sure it's not going to make a liar out of me. But the way I do it, it, this is how I found that it shows up for me each time. You know, this time I'm going to go in, I'll fly into it, I'll do an order save, and show, doesn't show up. And here's Sean, look, 
Why is my ship halfway in the ground again? No. I have nothing for you, Dan. Sorry. Okay. So here's how we do it. Alright. I'll go up. Fly up. We'll get up in here. Alright. Go up here. Over to the space, uh, space station. Not the anomaly. Yeah. It's my first day off in a long time, guys. So I'm kind of relaxed a little bit. Trying to enjoy this. So, so hopefully you enjoy it too. So we're going to get into the space station. Then we get to sit in the back, so we can see our ships coming in. Alright, so, eh, stand still. Don't matter if you stand still or not. You still gotta reload it. Hey, right, watch, maybe if I run around, it'll come in. It's a pretty decent looking ships coming in this thing. So. You wait for these guys to load up. You reload your auto save, and I can almost guarantee that it will show up for you guys. Okay? Uh oh. Comes one coming in. Could he be on the first wave? Maybe he got to move. Okay. There he is. And there's another A. Okay. So if you got some nanites, you can pop it up to an S. Get it all built up real quick. What do you got, Junior? Hey, dude. I like your ship. Yeah. What do you got? Another A. 201402. Any of the shields are 231. So that's, you know, that's a pretty decent ship. You get the red and the silver, you know, I like, that's, I mean, I kind of like, oh look, oh my goodness, and there's another A coming right on this thing, guys, okay, you, you couldn't have uh, timed it better for me, I appreciate it, thank you, three grand for an A, okay, and you can build this thing up. Are all three of them here still? Look. One station. Three awesome ships. Okay. You got your red marlin. With the silver. And depending on how you look at it. It looks black. So that's kind of why I like it. Because I like to do red and black. So. And he's saying. Like I say. You got two A ships. You get. You know. You get in here. It's not going to take much to get you to update what you need to do, you know? And then put your other stuff on there, and you got a badass machine right there, okay? So, any of you can have this kind of ship if you like it, okay? I'm going to be looking around and see if I can find some more stuff that you guys like, okay? So, for me, I like this one. Um, I'm going to look some more, and I'll see you in the future, okay? Y'all have a good one. Thanks.